the new news, she's slaying the city. No makeup, just wake up and still giving the free. Get the lights, camera, and she cuts as big as a movie. And grab a seat and now tune with disastrous beauty. Me, it seems shorter than 20 inches. It's giving me 
16-ish, but maybe that's just a me thing. I don't know. Y'all let me know down below, but it doesn't feel or look like 20 inches to me. Now, it does say it's 150% density, I think. Am I making up stuff? Yeah. It does say it's 150% density, and to me, it is giving that. But as far as the length, I'm a little iffy about the length. Like, I don't know. But sometimes I get units that I feel like are way longer than what they say. And sometimes I get units that I feel like are way shorter. Y'all let me know down below in the comments if you feel like, oh, girl is giving what they say she's giving. Okay. Now, as far as shedding and tangling, honestly, I did not experience it. I can't lie to you. I didn't experience it. Okay. Um, but that's not to say at some point she won't. Okay. Because this is an $80 human hair wig. I expected at some point, but right out of the packaging, she did not serve me any other things. And I mean, I can't lie to you. I gotta tell you what this. Now, as far as tweezing and bleaching, none of that was done. I did bleach the unit myself, but it did not come done. And it, it did not come tweezed at all. I did tweeze it a little bit, and I hopefully I showed you guys that at the beginning, but I didn't tweeze it a whole lot. You guys know that ain't my forte, girl, okay? That ain't what she do. But I did try to do it a little bit for y'all, okay? So, give me my props, okay? I did try. And, yeah, that is pretty much it. Oh, Oh, big head friendly. In my opinion, this unit is big head friendly. I did have to adjust the straps. I am an average cap size. So I always deem a unit to be big head friendly if I have to really adjust the straps. If I don't, then I, I assume that it is small to medium head friendly. This particular wig, in my opinion, is medium to big head friendly. So girl, do that what you want to do with it because I only got the head that's on the shoulders. You feel me? You feel me? So yeah, that is pretty much it as far as the details and specs go with this wig. If you're interested in my pros and cons as well as the full 360, then please continue to watch. Okay, so my cons, because you know I like to start with the cons, so I like to end on a high note. My cons is there were little pieces in here somewhere. I don't even see them now. But there were little pieces that were like them little short pieces. So that is the con. And also, I don't feel like the length is what they said the length is. That's a con for me. It may not be a con for you because you may feel like it's 20 inches stretched out. I just don't. I just don't. And it's maybe because I'm used to dealing with, you know, hair that is longer than what it seems. But to me, I, it's just not giving 20. It's really giving me 18, 16-ish. So those are my cons with this unit. My pros with this wig is, first of all, it's a closure. You know you girl love a closure, honey. Okay, I love a closure. I also love the price. Like, I feel like you can't beat the price, especially with the shipping if you have Amazon Prime. It came super fast. It wasn't super expensive. I love that for me. So, those are my pros with this unit. I would... I would recommend this wig if you're wanting to try a human hair wig without spending a lot of money. If you're just kind of like branching off into it or maybe you're a beginner or whatever, I would definitely recommend this wig. I don't know if I would recommend this to somebody that is like somebody that's always wearing human hair. You know what I mean? Like you're used to a certain quality or you're used to this or you're used to that and da 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 Maybe not, but for somebody that's just kind of stepping off into there because let's keep it a whole book. A lot of the Syntheticas now are, are almost $80, okay? Like, the Syntheticas been tripping. So, <laughs> so if you're just kind of wondering what it's like and, um, you know, just trying to figure out if you even want to do human hair, I would recommend it for that purpose. It just kind of depends on you and where, what stage you are at, in my personal opinion. I'm not mad at this hair whatsoever. Um, I feel like I got... Um, I got what I paid for. That's just kind of like my thoughts, you know what I mean? But I think it just depends on you. So do whatever you want to do with that, baby. Okay? I'm throwing my Louisiana accent. Okay, do whatever what you want to do with that, baby. Okay? You got it, sis. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to go ahead and give you guys my full 360. I don't think I'm going to have to stand up for a lint check because to me, y'all, this hair is not giving me 20 inches and I'm 5'4". Okay? So... Yeah, so this is obviously the unit in the front. This is it on the left side. This is it in the back. And this is it on the right side. All right, y'all, so let me know down below.
below what you guys think. Let me know if you think it is worth it. If you don't think it's worth it, let me know if you purchased this hair and what you think of it. Let me know all of that down below. And also, don't forget to let me know if you think this unit is 20 inches. If I'm tripping or if I'm not tripping, let me know down below in the comments. I am interested in your thoughts and opinions. I will have a direct link to this wig down below in the description box for your convenience. Keep in mind that it will be an affiliate link. Um, so if you don't want your girl to get no points, then honey, don't buy it off that link, okay? And yeah, that is pretty much it. So yeah, girl, <laughs> that's all. That's all. So if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you have any questions that you feel like I may have left out, feel free to comment down below. And if you're not already subscribed, girl, click the subscribe button. It's not cost you not one red cent. And if you're not ready to follow me on all my social media platforms, I am Disastrous Beauty on both IG and TikTok. I'm Healthy Miss D on Snapchat and I'm Disastrous B on Twitter. And I will see you love bucks next time. Bye.